and gentlemen, get ready for our first game of the day. One line, any direction. Under the O, 62. B, 4. G, 53. 18. Bingo! Whoa, she's good. N, 44. Yo, Chet, I get B7, we're going to be so rich. Come on, no whammies, no whammies. B, 9. Phew, I thought it was malignant. N, 41. B, 7. Bingo! Ah! Boom shakalaka. Uh, my hip. Bingo! Oh, okay. $500, that's all right. Bingo! 250 that's cool. Bingo! Mm. Bingo! Mm. Bingo! What a joke. Well, at least we got enough for two cartridges. Stay away from here, you dirty cockroach! Oh. Oh. Saturday's off? Saturday was like three days ago, you idiot! Oh, that's bad, right? I never want to see you again! <laughs> you are the ladies' man. Before we start, boys, I want you both to put away your games. And I mean it this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Smiths, keep it together. Don't let them get to you. Whoa, see that? <laughs> Whoa, that was pretty hardcore, even for skits. Yeah, he's pretty rattled. Maybe all this mocking is getting out of hand. Maybe we should just stop. Well, if we can. Yeah, we could easily stop. Yeah, easily. All right, that's it. No more mugs. Now we can stop for real. Yeah, but I just thought of an idea to make sure we actually stop this time. Do you really think all this stuff is necessary? Chet, in order to relinquish the mods, we must be properly prepared. For this, we will need one room, which we will not leave. Homework, two piles of pre-baked pizza snacks, one box of Calcium enriched orange juice, not from Cod's carton of. One six hour VHS videotape of totally sick wipeouts from the extremely extreme games. Sounds good. All right. <gasps> See ya! I need to talk to you, Sally. Okay, let's go up to my room. 
So, tell me. Oh, but it's like so embarrassing. Tell me. Okay. I'm like still so addicted to Timmy Youngblood. Two years of counseling, therapy, wasted. It all started three years ago, before he went solo and he was still with Magnetic. I was like totally their biggest fan. Oh, and Timmy was so hot. Like, every time he sings, I feel like his crystal blue eyes are staring into mine, and I'm the only one he sees. Seriously? Yeah, but after a while, it seemed he was becoming more distant. I remember, like, writing him a letter one night. Dear Tim, I wrote you, but you, like, still ain't calling. I put my cell, my pager, and, like, my home number at the bottom. I'm not peeve, though. I just want to be more special than your other fans. So here's a watch I'm sending you. I hope you wear it. And how are the other guys in the band? Lou, Chris, RJ, and Garrett? I'm sure you, like, hear this every day, but I'm so your biggest fan. I even have that limited edition of you frowning in the picture on the cola can. I can totally see what you're saying in your songs. Sometimes I even see you in my room singing to me when I put them on. I want to make my girlfriends jealous when we talk one-on-one. -on -one. We could go to movies, hold hands, have lots of fun. When I go to see you in concert, I wear fake tattoos across my cheeks. Please, like, write me back, Timmy. I've been trying you for weeks. Anyways, I hope you get this. Please don't diss me. Forever yours. Sincerely, Fitzy. Wow! I had no idea you were so hooked. Why didn't you tell me? Well, like, considering the phase you were going through, I didn't really think you'd understand. Yeah, that's true. So anyway, I couldn't, like, wait any longer. I had to prove to Timmy that I was, like, more than just a fan. Yo, this is T. Hi, it's your number one fan, Bitsy. Leave the word, I'll hit you back. Beep. <laughs> Timmy, you're such a funny guy. I know you're there. I can see you. You are such a sight. So after they charged me with, like, trespassing, I was ordered to go to boy band counseling. Tonight's my last meeting, but I don't think I'm even close to being over Timmy. You want me to go with you? For support? Yeah, that would really help me. Tonight's the hardest step. The burning of the paraphernalia. Even my Timmy undies. Ew! You so need my help, Bits. So, how much do we have? Barely enough for two cartridges. No! A breakdown! We are the unluckiest people on Earth! Why did I let the mugs take over my life? Three reasons. But I'm gonna change. I'm done mugging. I'm moving on. Going straight. Choose it in life. I'm looking forward to it already. Yeah, like, it's the craziest thing. After I smack my bean against my steering wheel, I don't even remember who this Timmy guy is. Here it goes. 
I'm gonna be just like all the other kids. The job, the family, the good grades, the bulbous biceps and unrivaled popularity. Yeah, yeah, I heard them all a half an hour ago. You're forgetting one thing, though, boys. Pirated software is illegal. And for that, you'll have to choose once more. Can you hear me? Can you see me? Yes, yes sir! Poker or bag? Bag, I guess. <laughs> huh? <gasps>